So, at CMM Cares, let's talk a minute about the culture, because obviously you have to have a support mechanism, not just from the C-suite, but it has to permeate through the whole organization. Tell me a little bit about the culture at, at CMM. Sure, so it was probably two years ago that I realized if we're gonna grow, I have to, I personally, as the managing partner, have to let go of a lot of the things that I was doing so that I could be freed up to be out in the community more and really start to recognize needs. It's a very difficult thing to do. Listen, when you grow it, it's your baby. You know, and I've been advising people for 25 years, but I was now realizing I need to eat my own dog food at this point, and I gotta let go. So what I was able to do is take, you know, a group of eight of our top professionals, not, not, mostly non-lawyers who are heading up our business units and form my leadership council, which is great. And I've empowered them to basically run the day-to-day business, every extent. You know, we, we, we really looked at it. I've empowered them all. I have a, a meeting once a month with them. I have breakout meetings with them. But other than that, you know, they have to make the decisions. And you have to learn to live with that. And that's a hard thing for me to have learned to live with. But they're going to make mistakes. It's going to cost you money. But that's all part of the growing curve. They are amazing, though. Every single one of them is, uh, is amazing, has embraced it, takes it very seriously, learns from their mistakes, is not defensive, owns it. So leadership and ownership are, are two things that were very big. They own the problem, and, uh, and we've been able to grow, right? So we've been able to grow the infrastructure. That's enabled me and my other partners to get out into the community and really find needs to be able to serve.